Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. Today's wisdom will be coming from out of the book of Matthew, Matthew chapter number 20, verse number 34. That's Matthew chapter 20, verse 34, and it reads, And Jesus had compassion on them. He touched their eyes, and immediately their eyes received sight, and they followed him. Today I want to talk about grace and mercy. Grace and mercy. Grace is God giving us what we don't deserve. Mercy is God withholding that which we deserve. When you put grace and mercy together, you get Christ, God, redemption at Christ's expense. You get the favor of God. Jesus Christ and this disciple, along with the multitude, were going to Jerusalem to the annual feast, the feast of Passover, where Jesus Christ himself would be ultimately our Passover. He went in Jerusalem, uh, uh, Jericho and out of Jericho, and there were two blind men heard it was Jesus. They began to cry out, saying, Lord, son of David, have mercy uh, uh, upon us. They cried out for mercy and they began to cry out to his Jewish, uh, uh, the Jewish popular name of the Messiah. They were crying out to the Messiah, but the multitude uh, rebuked them and told them to hold their peace. Isn't it amazing how people will celebrate you on today and they will crucify you on tonight? But these men kept on crying out even the more because he, they, they were not trying to get the people's attention. They were trying to get Jesus Jesus attention and so they kept crying out and the Bible said Jesus stood still in verse 32 and Jesus stood still and called them and said what would you have me to do it was in verse number 33 that they said that Lord you would open up eyes 30, verse 34 the Bible said Jesus had compassion upon him that is Jesus showed love and action he touched their eyes and immediately their eyes sight was open and they followed them. Listen, these men were chained. These men were converted. And the first thing they did was when their eyes was open, they began to follow Jesus. Of course, Lamentation, the book of Lamentation says, this I recall in my mind. It is the Lord mercy that we are not consumed because his compassion faileth not. For they are new every morning. Great is thy faithfulness, God is a faithful God. He give you and I favor every morning. He give us his grace and his mercy. When he open up our eyes, we ought to do what these two blind men do. We ought to follow him. Follow him everywhere we go. Take him with us. That is, let him lead us. Let him guide us. Let him direct us. God bless you today real good. May he smile upon you, be gracious unto you, and give you peace. That's my prayer for you and your family today. Grace and mercy.